Good evening and welcome to the first of our three performances that will make up our Oryx Winter Concerts this year. Today is the turn of our talented young performers from years four, five, and six. Just before we get started, a few points for the smooth running of the event. If the alarm sounds, it will not be a drill. The fire exits are at the rear and the sides of the auditorium as marked. We will assemble outside in the area on the left of the auditorium as you're currently facing. So that's uh, this side over here. Uh, please allow the students to line up with their ensembles to be registered before either returning into the concert or departing, depending on instructions given at the time. Uh, okay, please turn mobile phones to off or to silent mode. If you wish to take photos or videos, please do not share any media that contains images of students other than your own children. Uh, please also switch off the flash uh, so as not to disturb the performers. Uh, finally, please remain seated during the performances and we'll have a great concert. So we've got a great, uh, fantastic program lined up for you today. And I'd like to hand over now to our two MCs, uh, Shanini, uh, Sharuni, my apologies, and Lasia. Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to our spectacular winter concert here at Oryx International School. I'm Shiruni, and I'm joined by the wonderful Lassia, and we're your hosts for the evening. That's right. Tonight we have a fantastic lineup of talented performers ready to entertain you with their wonderful acts. Ladies and gentlemen, hold on to your cocoa cups because it's about to get cozy in here. Let's kick off the evening with our incredible choir performing hot chocolate. And do not worry, no marshmallows were harmed in the making of this performance. Let's put our hands together for the choir. Wasn't that delightful? 
another round of applause for these young talents. Now, as our fantastic choir gracefully exits the stage, let me share a quick winter theme joke to keep the mood light. Why did the snowman bring a broom to the concert? Well, he wanted to sweep the audience off their feet. <laughs> winter humor, it never gets old. While our choir members make their way off the stage, let's take a moment to appreciate their dedication and hard work they put into preparing for tonight's concert. It's no small feat to coordinate 80 plus voices and they've truly brought the warmth of the season to our hearts. They sure did. Well done, choir. Now, do you want to hear another cool joke? Okay, here goes. How did the snowman get to the concert? He rode an icicle. <laughs> snowman and their adventures. Looks like our choir has just about left the stage. And I must say, they've set the bar high for the rest of the performers tonight. But fear not, we have an incredible lineup ahead that will keep the winter magic alive. So, without further ado, Let's continue our musical journey with the next act. Please welcome Dia, who will be enchanting us with her piano and singing skills with Etrans Perfect. Can we give Dia a big round of applause? Bravo, Dia. That was truly perfect. Your performance just painted a smile on everyone's faces. Can we get another round of applause for Dia's fantastic performance? Now, as Dia leaves the stage, get ready for a unique performance by our year six students. They'll be showcasing their talents with handbells. And trust me, it's going to be a it's going to be music to your ears. But before we dive into the delightful of handbells, how about another quick joke to keep the spirits high? Why can't you give Elsa a balloon? Because she'll let it go. 
the wonders of winter jokes. Now, let's welcome our year six students to the stage as they bring the magic of handbells to the life of with the lively tune of Rio Samba. of sounds. Amazing job, Year 6. I felt like I was transported to the streets of Rio during Carnival. Let's give them another round of applause. Now, get ready for a lively performance that will have you tapping your feet and singing along. Let's give a big warm welcome to Keisha, who will be bringing a burst of energy to the stage with her rendition of Almost There from the Disney movie, The Princess and the Frog. Can we give Keisha a big round of applause? That's just gonna have to wait a while Ain't got time for messing around And it's not my style This old town can slow you down People taking the easy way But I know exactly where I'm going Getting closer, closer every day And I'm almost there I'm almost there People down here think I'm crazy But I don't care Trials and tribulations I've had my share 
But there ain't nothing gonna stop me now Cause I'm almost there I remember daddy told me Fairy tales can come true You've got to make them happen It all depends on you So I work real hard each and every day Now things for sure are going my way Just doing what I do Look out boys and I'm coming through And I'm almost there I'm almost there People gonna come here from everywhere And I'm almost there But I've climbed the mountain, I've crossed the river And I'm almost there I'm almost there And I'm almost What a beautiful performance. Keisha, you have such a captivating voice. That performance has left us all feeling uplifted and ready for more. Now, as our next act gets prepared, I've got another joke to tell to keep the mood light. Why did the snowman go to the concert? Because he heard it was going to be an eyes performance. This snowman is quite the showman, isn't he? Now, let's welcome our next act. Get ready for an incredible performance by our Year 5 students. They'll be using a mix of boomwhackers and body percussion to take us on a rhythmic journey within the Hall of the Mountain King. But just before we delve into the mountainous melodies, Let's take a moment to appreciate the creativity and dedication these Year 5 students have put in their performance. It's not every day you see boom whackers and body percussion creating magic together on stage. I can't wait to see what you have in store for us. The stage is all yours, Year 5. And now, without further ado, let's give some encouragement to our Year 5 as they perform their creative interpretation of In the Howl of the Mountain King. Take it away, Ear 5.
Bravo, Year 5. That was both creative and captivating. You truly transported us to the Mountain King's realm. I don't know about you guys, but I've never seen such musical creativity. It looked like so much fun. Let's give another big round of applause for our talented Year 5 performers. <laughs> As our year five students exit the stage, here's another amazing joke for you all. What's a snowman's favorite song? Freeze a jolly good fellow. The jokes just keep on getting better and better. Now, let's prepare for our next act. Up next, we have the incredibly talented Noah, who will be serenading us all with the soulful tunes on his ukulele. Get ready for a musical journey that will make you want to kick back, relax, and enjoy the sweet sounds of I'm Yours. Can we give Noah a big round of applause?
open up your mind and see like me. Open up your plans and damn you're free. Look into your heart, you find that the sky is yours. No, please don't, please don't, please don't. There's no need to complicate, cause our time is short. This or this or this is our fate. I'm yours. Fantastic job, Noah. Your charming vocals and ukulele skills have spread joy throughout the room. The way you effortless, effortlessly strummed those strings and sang with such warmth brought smiles to every face in the audience. Let's give Noah another round of applause for creating such a delightful atmosphere. Now, get ready for a graceful dance performed by Polina. She'll be performing Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy from the Nutcrackers. So can we give Polina a big round of applause and invite her onto the stage? That was a mesmerizing display of elegance and grace. Your dance truly transported us to a magical realm where fairies twirl and dance in enchanted wonder. You've left us all spellbound with your beautiful dance. Can we get another round of applause for Polina's beautiful performance? And now, folks, let's keep the magic alive as we move on to our next act. Please welcome our year four Glockenspiel Ensemble to the stage as they bring us their rendition of Song of the Bells. But just before they perform, it's worth nothing that these talented youngsters are the youngest performers in tonight's concert. 
Despite their age, their musical skills promises to be a symphony of miniature belts, each note resonating with passion and effort. Our young musicians have invested a lot of time in this. So with, with hearts full of anticipation, let's welcome Ear 4 as they, the youngest performers of tonight, performing the captivating song of the bells. Wasn't that fantastic? Who wants to play year four, play the glockenspiels again? You all don't seem too sure about it. The stage is all yours, year five, year four. That was truly delightful. Year four, your Glockenspiel Ensemble was a harmonious journey that echoed through the auditorium. It's amazing how those tiny bells can create such a symphony of sounds. Let's give a big hand to year four for their magical performance. Now, as we savor the lingering magic of those delightful walk and spill notes, here's another joke. Why did the snowman go to the concert? Because he, was, he heard it was going to be snow good. Go. Oh, snow good. I get it. Now, 
While we enjoy good laugh, let's extend our gratitude to all the talented young performers who have graced our stage tonight. Each act has been a shining example of the incredible creativity and dedication present in our school community. Now, let's shift our focus back to the stage. Coming up next, we have the incredibly talented Maria. Let's give, some, let's give her some encouragement, folks. Coming the incredibly talented Maria, who will be gracing us with I Can't Help by Elvis Presley.
Maria. That was more than just a performance. It was a journey through the heart. Your rendition of I Can't Help was absolutely stunning. You brought a timeless classic to life with such emotion and grace. Let's express our gratitude for Maria's exceptional talent with another round of applause. Now, ladies and gentlemen, prepare for our thrilling crescendo to our winter concert. Our next performance is not just a song, it's an experience. Get ready to be swept away by the dynamic and mesmerizing voices of our choir as they present Whisper. Please put your hands together as we welcome them back onto the stage. <laughs> As we give our choir some time to assemble on stage, there is one. There is time for one more joke. Do you want to? Do you want to hear it? Yeah. Why did the snowman bring a ladder to the concert? To reach the high note. <laughs> You're right. That was the best one yet. Now. To set the stage for our grand finale, I want to take a moment to acknowledge all the hard work and dedication of all the performers tonight. Each act has been a unique masterpiece and we are grateful for the diversity of talents that have filled this auditorium. With that said, let's welcome our choir, a harmonious assemble of 80 plus voices ready to create a magical moment with Whisper. Let's give them some encouragement. What an incredible evening 
filled with unforgettable moments. A big round of applause for all our performers tonight. And speaking of unforgettable moments, let's listen again to our amazing choir for a special encore performance. They prepared a little surprise to leave you with a lasting memory of tonight's concert. But just before they sing, we just want to say, may the magic of tonight's music stay with you now and always. Let's enjoy this special treat from our talented choir. If just one person believes in you Deep enough and strong enough believes in you Hard enough and long enough Before you know it Someone else would think If he can do it I can do it Making it too Ladies and gentlemen, what a fantastic concert we've just witnessed. Could we have another round of applause for all the amazing musicians in front of us? I've got to say, we did our summer concerts here, which were the first concerts uh, we've been able to do since COVID. And I thought, wow, that was amazing. But tonight's really gone above and beyond. So very, very well done, boys and girls. You're absolutely fantastic tonight. Very good. Okay, but it is time to finish, and before we leave, I do have a few thanks to say. Uh, of course, thanks to all the performers who did an excellent job, uh, but also our MCs, uh, Shuni, uh, Shuni, and last year. Could we give them a big clap? Are you still there, girls? What have you got? Wave it is. I know you did a great job. Well done. Um, and there's a range of staff involved that maybe you wouldn't have seen. So uh, Mr. Gary is in the box behind us, controlling the lights and the screen and the sound. If we could give him a big clap. And we've had a huge amount of uh, help from our support staff putting this concert together, whether it's moving instruments, setting up the stage, making sure the auditorium's ready. So I'd like to say a big thank you to all the support staff we have in school as well. We've had a great deal of help from people in the, uh, from teaching colleagues and our sixth form prefect team who've been helping us get everyone seated and make sure the concert's running smoothly. So a big thanks to those people as well.
And now it's time for us to say thank you to you, because obviously without your support and attendance, taking children to school, making sure they're ready, their school uniforms, making sure they know their words for the songs, we would not be able to do such a great concert. So boys and girls, can we give your mums and dads and families a huge thank you, please? There are two very special people as well I need to mention, and you will have seen them working tremendously hard today, whether it's directing, playing the piano, setting up microphones, helping the students. Could we please give a huge round of applause to our wonderful primary music teachers, Mrs. Salazar and Mrs. Navarro. There they are, wow. Okay, so. Boys and girls, can I ask us to all come onto the stage and then we'll figure out how we're going to be dismissed. Well done again and thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. So whilst the boys and girls are coming on stage, um, I do have one more joke if you'd like one. I can't, I can't promise this is as good as the others, but you, won't, you might not believe this, but a great big polar bear walked into my classroom the other day and it said to me, I was a bit surprised, because polar bears don't usually talk. Anyway, he said to me, Good afternoon, Mr. Pickering. How are you today? I said, I'm fine, thank you. Why the big pause? Ah, uh, yeah, you get it now. There you go. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I, I think the children's jokes were probably better. Yeah, I think so. Right, so um, what will happen is we'll ask the students in year four to go with Mrs. Dewey. Mrs. Dewey, could you come down to the front, please? Uh, uh, Mrs. Dewey will have to tick off the students as they leave from year four to make sure they go to the correct people. I think, actually, uh, Mr. Jesus, could you do us a big favor? Just get a photograph of all the performers together when they're all seated. We'd really appreciate that. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you'd like to take a photo, please remain seated because we do have to get everyone out. But if Let's take a photo of all the boys and girls seated on the stage. You'll be most welcome. There we go. Hello? Ah, I'm still, I'm back. <laughs> uh, just before we didn't dismiss the students, uh, wrong request for parents. Please remember to sign out as you leave the auditorium with your students. So we'll need to tick the students off our registers. Uh, but parents, if you'd remember to sign out on the uh, parents list as we go, that would be much appreciated. Okay, year four students, please could you stand up and very carefully make your way off the stage, that side. And if you go with Mrs. Dewey to the school, uh, the auditorium lobby, then you'll be able to meet your parents there. So if you're a parent of a year four student, if you could make your way to the lobby, we'll dismiss the year four students from there. Mm -hmm.